We're back with another little tutorial on the edge. Today, we're going to have a look at some of the patch bay connections that we can do. That opens up so many different things. The first one that you might not have considered is how to mess with the tempo. If I start the playback of the, the edge running, whatever the tempo is set here. And you can control the tempo here, you can control the tempo with MIDI in, or you can control it with the patch bay. So if I take a connection to the clock advance and come from oscillator one, so this is the outputs, this is the inputs. And then if I hit play, change the pitch of the oscillator that is controlling with an up and down motion because the oscillator is going up and down constantly that's controlling the speed of the progression so I'll turn this volume down and we'll just play oscillator 2 and if we turn the pitches up a little bit And now, if we change the speed of the sequence with this, we can get some quite funky effects. So that's kind of fun. Where this connection to the clock advance is really handy, is if I jump over to my TR8S. If I take a connection from the trigger out and stick it into the clock advance, I am using the TR8S's triggers to tell the edge when to move forward in timing. So if I hit play here, nothing is moving now on the timeline. But I hit play on here, that moves the clock here. If I press the last two channels here, that gives me access to the triggers that the TRAS sends out. So I can change how frequently the edge progresses in its timeline. In that way, we can get some quite interesting changes to the timing. So a tip would be to think about the clock advance and what else you can map through to it to give you some variation in timings. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that comment or if you've got any questions or anything like that. I will come back with another patch as soon as I can. Uh, and the, the big thing to take away from this is that the Clock Advance really is great with external gear. Uh, if you've got something like the TR8S or a modular setup, the sky's the limit and you can really change up the rhythms using that. So take care and I'll see you next time.